The US Air Force has quietly built and flown a brand new aircraft prototype that could become its next generation fighter, the service's top acquisition official announced Tuesday. Dr. Will Roper, Assistant Secretary of the Air Force for Acquisition, Technology and Logistics, revealed during the virtual 2020 Air, Space and Cyber Conference that the new aircraft is part of the next generation air dominance MGAD program, which defies the traditional categorization of a single platform, featuring a network of advanced fighter aircraft, sensors and weapons in a growing and unpredictable threat environment. He said, Next Generation Air Dominance Program right now is designing, assembling, testing in the digital world, exploring things that would have cost time and money to wait for physical world results. Next Generation Air Dominance Program has come so far that the full-scale flight demonstrator has already flown in the physical world. But, Roper declined to give specifics on the project except that the craft was created using digital engineering, which allows the service to bypass the regular manufacturing process for parts and gives developers more flexibility to design and change blueprints. He also said that the new aircraft has broken a lot of records and is showing digital engineering isn't a fluke. He declined to comment on whether the defense industry has taken part in the endeavor. While he touted the expedited process of digital methods, we don't want our adversaries to know what they are, Roper added. Therefore it's not clear which defense contractor designed and prototyped the new jet, though it's almost certainly one of the big aerospace giants, Lockheed Martin, Northrop Grumman, and Boeing. Also it's not clear where it flew and where it is now. However the new aircraft is presumed to be the US Air Force's first sixth generation tactical aircraft after the fifth generation F-22 and F-35 fighter jets. The most interesting, and perhaps revolutionary, thing about next generation air dominance program and GAD is that the Air Force developed and built it in just one year. The world hasn't seen such a short development time since World War II. And please don't forget to subscribe this channel to watch upcoming videos.